Hello friends! Tonkline was once officially shut down, but like a phoenix rising from the ashes, it has emerged as one of the top 15 cryptocurrencies. Despite Pavel Durva's public renouncement of the blockchain, Tonkoin is currently being integrated into Telegram. The question remains, can the young genius Pavel Durov successfully implement his plan and what will be the future value of Tonkoin once fully integrated into Telegram ecosystem? So let's figure it out, hit a like, subscribe to the channel and let's get started. In 2018, Pavel Durov and his brother Nikolai came up with a solution to monetize Telegram using their own cryptocurrency. This project was conceived as a payment system built into the messenger with its own blockchain. Initially, Ton was supposed to become a blockchain platform and its own cryptocurrency was called Gram. Serious investments amounting to $1.7 billion of dollars were attracted to the development of the project, and all interested programmers were invited to develop code and smart contracts. But the problems began after that. Pavel Durov closed Stone blockchain platform. The fact is that in 2019 SEC went to court with a demand to suspend the activities of Ton project, because Telegram violated securities law since the tokens which were then called Gram were sold to US citizens. The project fell into the clutches of the regulator and Durov was ordered to return 1.2 billion of dollars to investors. The launch of the project was stopped, and in his blog Durov wrote that unfortunately the American court stopped Ton project. But that was not the end, because it was an open source and many development teams decided to continue Durov's work, and one actually succeeded, which later happened to be recognized by Pavel himself. Anatoly Makosov and Kirill Yemelyanenka, members of a community called Newton, developed the Toncoin cryptocurrency, which was later rebranded from Telegram Open Network to the Open Network. Toncoin experienced significant growth during the bull market, increasing from $0.59 cents to $4.5, providing investors with a return of around 7x. The Open Network is a first-level blockchain designed by Telegram to attract a large user base, boasting fast transactions, low fees, user-friendly applications, and environmental friendliness. The team's goal is to create a complete ecosystem with decentralized storage services, a domain name system, an anonymous platform network, instant payments, and fast transaction processing. The TON network stands out for its fast transaction confirmation, processing a record 55,000 transactions per second in September 2021. Without the involvement of Pavel and Nikolai Durov, the Ton coin may have been forgotten as just another altcoin. However, the project was given new life, and the current situation is promising. If you find this video interesting, leave a like and subscribe in order to support the channel's development. Thank you, and let's move on. Pavel Durov is gradually embracing his project Toncoin and has publicly stated that he holds it alongside Bitcoin. The Ton blockchain now boasts over 500 products and services including NFT tokens, bridges between blockchains, staking, domain marketplaces, multifunctional wallets and DeFi services. Ton's ecosystem also includes unique services such as Ton Storage, a decentralized storage similar to Dropbox that uses private key encryption to enhance storage security, and Ton Proxy, its own proxy server. DNS Ton is a high-profile ecosystem project that allows users to purchase easy-to-remember names instead of complex strings, numbers, and letters. Ton Services is a service for developers to create and launch their own decentralized applications, which automatically enter the searchable registry of all services on the blockchain. Ton also has its own services for creating and selling NFTs, called Face Ticker and Ton Diamonds. Since the beginning of 2023, Ton has integrated the function of exchanging encrypted messages on the network, which positions itself as a transaction for which a commission of approximately one cent will be charged. In September 2023, Telegram integrated a crypto wallet based on Ton, and from November, users will have access to this wallet except for residents of the United States and several other countries. All operations on this blockchain are paid for in Ton coins, making this cryptocurrency more valuable. Ton coin has shown good results, rising to 11th place in terms of capitalization in the coin market cap rating, with a circulating volume of over 3 billion of tokens and a capitalization exceeding 6.5 billion of dollars. However, the majority of tokens from the entire emission is in several wallets belonging to Ton Foundation or to those who are connected to this organization. Although the project's business has improved, there is still uncertainty about its future. 
So today the price of Ton coin looks overheated, as indicated not only by the current correction but also by many indicators. Even if locally we are still in a kind of upward trend, but until the asset breaks through the resistance zone of $3 and consolidates above, we should not expect a long-term increase. It seems more likely that the asset will continue its correction with further distribution of coins into the hands of retail investors. Conservatively, I believe that we can still see a decline of Ton coin to the area of 90 cents and below. In the bull market, Toncoin can show quite good growth. The first goal is to break the historical maximum, which is $5.5. But I don't think that the price will stop there or go down, because Toncoin hasn't really started to hype yet. Due to the good utility of the token and the large community which currently reaches almost 2 million of people, the price of the coin can increase significantly. But the real hype will begin when Telegram actually implements Web 3.0 technology and then we will see the real use of this cryptocurrency. It's no secret that on Fragment Marketplace users can already purchase unique usernames, phone numbers and even premium subscriptions to Telegram for tokens. This hype may be caused by the fact that when purchasing a phone number or username, the user will receive advanced features in the messengers, for example verification. Such a mass adoption can primarily occur due to the fact that the number of Telegram users exceeds 800 million of people. What blockchain can boast of so many regular users? And if Toncoin reaches a capitalization of 100 billion of dollars during the next bull market, then the approximate price of the token could vary from 25 to 30 dollars, depending on the emission. But why, even with so many big advantages, would I still be careful with the project and would not run to sell all my property to buy Toncoins? First First of all, the opinion that I am now expressing is not a financial advice and you always should make all purchasing decisions yourself. But the fact that most of the volume of coins is concentrated in the hands of one group of people, so they can easily manipulate the price for their own benefits. And I'm also worried about SEC figuring out Pavel's Durov game with the implementation of Toncoin into the messenger and the courts will start again. So hope you find this video useful guys, uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next videos. Thank you.